Joe, Edinburgh Derby week, what's this week been like in the lead up to this fixture? Yeah, good. Um, a really good training week. I've had a, obviously a f few days um, leading into it with no midweek game, so it's, we've had a lot of information and a lot of work on the training ground. Um, so yeah, so no excuses, we're all ready. Um, like I said, good week preparation, everyone's buzzing. Yeah, five games unbeaten now, unbeaten in the whole of September. The lads must take a lot of confidence going into a fixture like this. Yeah, definitely. Um, like I say, five unbeaten with some really good performances in there. Probably feel like we should have had a little bit more out of the, um, the results that we have have had. So uh, yeah, confidence is high since the, the gaffer and the guys have come in. It's been a been a good turnaround um, and yeah everyone's just embracing it everyone's everyone's really enjoying it learning new things every day and um, and you know getting used to how they work and what they want from us so it's been it's been really good yeah let's talk about the derby then there's been quite a lot of new faces coming into the club um, in the summer um, like so Dylan Vente, Jordan Nobita for those guys that haven't experienced the derby have you or some of the more senior guys spoken to them and told them what it's about or, or how does that work? Yeah, so obviously you'll have like passing conversations and be, there's no like formal sit down and say, right, expect this and this is what it means and all that. But, you know, living living here like the guys will will be doing now and, and being around the place, um, they'll know, they know what it means. Um, and obviously the longer they're, hit, they're here, the more it'll, it'll mean to them personally, like it has done for a, a lot of us. So, um, but yeah, there'll be no... There'll be no um, confusion or um, naivety going into it from any of the new guys. There's enough of us who have been here and played in enough of the games now to to kind of, you know, let them know and and, and get them ready for and what to expect really, but in a good way because you know, these are these are the best games. So, um, yeah, it looks like everyone's looking forward to it and I'm sure the new guys are definitely. Yes, yeah, your 11th Edinburgh derby. How much does this fixture mean to you? Yeah, so it's good. It's, it's um, yeah, I can't lie. It's the one you know. We all look look at the as soon as the fixture list comes out. It's the first one that you look for. The one that you know. These are the games that you you enjoy more than any. You enjoy playing every game. Don't get me wrong, but there's obviously something extra special in this. Um, and yeah, personally, I, I love playing in them. Um, uh, obviously, lucky enough to do something I love for a job and. And these games are the one, like the the cherry cherry on top, really, when they when they come off. Just finally, then this season you've taken that armband a few times. I think it's four already. How much would it mean to you to lead the boys out in an Edinburgh derby? Yeah, um, if that's the case, then it would obviously mean a lot. You know, it's something I don't take lightly at all. It's something I've really enjoyed. Um, a few occasions I have done it. Um, you know, if Paul's not playing, then I'm more than happy to. So, you know, take the responsibility and something like I say, something I've really enjoyed. So, um, so yeah, if, if that's the case again, then then it's something I'll I'll be very proud. But if not, then Paul, Paul's our captain, and and you know that's he's rightly so. He's he's our number one. Nice one, Joe. Good luck on Saturday. Cheers, pal. Thank you.